In this video, we would see how to deploy a Maven third-party artifact to a remote repository in Nexus. Let us start. For example, this is the artifact we need to deploy to Nexus remote repository. To deploy this artifact, we need some details. The details are Maven coordinates for the artifact. We have to identify group ID, artifact ID, version and packaging of the artifact. And also we need to get the Nexus repository details like the remote repository URL and also the credentials for this repository. So this is the URL of the remote repository in which we will upload our artifact. So for credentials, we have to open the settings.xml and we have to identify the server ID for this repository. So let me open the settings.xml. So in this, we have a server ID corresponding to Nexus. So the credentials of the remote repository are stored in the server section of settings.xml. So we have assigned here the ID. The ID is very important. So we have to mention this ID in our command. Let me close the file. So now we have got the repository ID. Now we have got the required details. We will use all these details in the maven deploy command to deploy a third party artifact. So we have to use maven deploy plugin here. So this deploy plugin will use deploy file as the goal. So now we have to specify the coordinates of the artifact. For that group ID, so let me give form dot test and artifact ID. So this is the artifact name and version we have to specify. So here the version is 2.0. So then we have to provide packaging as well. So this is a chart. These are the Maven coordinates for the third party artifact. So now let us specify the file path location. So for that we need to specify with the file is equal to. So we have to provide the local file location. And then we need to specify the repository ID. Nexus which is present in the settings.xml. And finally we have to specify the URL. So this URL should be the URL of the remote repository. So now we have all the details. Let us copy this command and execute. Now we can see that it is executing deploy plugin, deploy file board, and it is uploading the artifact to Nexus. The third party artifact is successfully uploaded to Nexus. So in addition to the artifact, it is also uploading corresponding form file as well. Now we can verify in Nexus whether the file is uploaded by logging into Nexus. So I am logging into Nexus now. So now we can browse the repository. So we can see in the releases. So now we can see that our third party artifact is successfully uploaded to Nexus remote repository which is MyAuth Maven releases. So this is how we can upload a third party artifact to Nexus repository using Maven deploy command. I hope this video is useful to you. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching.